In this assignment, you have to write an embedded C program to display the particular pattern on the LEDs controlled by the switches. The pattern is similar to the previous assignment 1. That means the LEDs have to glow as if a train is coming out of a tunnel and entering again into the tunnel in both directions, that is left to right and right to left alternately. You should note that the direction of the flow should be changed by a key press. Now coming to the output requirements, you can see 8 LEDs on the board. The LEDs have to glow one by one as if a train bogey is coming out of a tunnel every second from left to right by default as soon as the board is powered on or reset. The direction of the glow would remain as it is until and unless the direction input is detected. The direction of glow should change when the direction input is pressed and remain the same until the next input. The direction input can occur at any position and the train should change the direction instantly. This assignment will help you learn and understand the basic working of the port, working of LEDs, how LEDs are interfaced with the port, similarly how to interface the digital switches to the microcontroller, concepts of current sourcing and current syncing, concepts of pull up and pull down resistors and need of them and concepts of bouncing and debouncing effects on the tactile switches prerequisites you should have knowledge on input output port configuration that means how to configure the port pins as input or output and how to configure the port pins as digital or analog similarly you should also know the working principle of leds and tactile switches where you have to take care of debouncing the input that we require for this assignment is switch controlled Use the first digital key switch SW15 as direction input among the four digital keys on keypad. Please note that you have to use program cycles to implement the above program.